What's going on, people? It's your boy, Big Toast. And today, I have a review for you. First impression, unboxing of, ooh, yeah. Let's get it right. Eternal Ooh by Latifah Pride. That's right, I got it in, y'all. So we gonna smell this thing today. There's a big hype about this fragrance, you know? I hope it's good, you know, because a lot of people been talking good about it, so I really hope it's good. Also, I hope and pray that it's not damaged. A lot of people get it in when they come in. It comes with like a little plastic, um, like dome for the fragrance, but a lot of people be cracked. And unfortunately, I got this in today and my FedEx driver, he tossed it on the porch. I got cameras at the crib, he tossed it. I always got an issue with this same guy. You know what I mean? Sometimes I get a package that you gotta sign for. Well, he'll just tap on my screen door instead of knocking. He'll give you 10 seconds, he'll write the note and just pull off. Yeah, I got beef with him. You know what I mean? But anyway, yo, we about to unbox this thing. See what it is. Eternal Ooh by La Tafa. So let's do it, y'all. See what we got. Unbox this drink. Got a nice box on it. Got a nice box on it. La Tafa Pride Audi Parfum. Nice little box. Got the serial numbers and all that on the back, you know. But let's open it up, see what we got. Oh, okay, you got a booklet. Nice booklet, you know. They got all the different um, fragrances on the inside of it. You know, the, the Latafa Pride. All of the, the new Latafa Pride um, fragrances. Okay, that's great, you know. Oh, so yeah, you take it out. Unfortunately, y'all, uh, it's too good to be true. Too good to be true. Hold up, oh snap. Okay, then it comes with like a little mantel piece for your uh, fragrance. Then here's your fragrance. You can set it in like that. It come with like this little foam piece, I guess, so you won't crack it. But unfortunately, the top of my glass has a crack in it. I blame the FedEx driver, but also, you know, Fragrance Buy, I got this from Fragrance Buy. Come on, y'all. They put it in the little box with very minimum of cushion. So, you gotta put this in a big box for this not to um, break like that. Come on, fragrance bro, let's go, baby. But anyway, let's take this out. First impressions. Let's smell what it's like. Look at this, it's a beautiful bottle. Beautiful, oh my Lord. It's heavy, metal cap. Damn, it's hard to get off too. Jesus, it's metal, it's beautiful. Look at the fragrance. Beautiful bottle. Has the tree on the front. Let's do the first impressions, baby. I know I'm holding y'all up from what y'all gotta do. You know what I'm saying? The intense, uh, knowing what it is. So we gonna go on skin with this one. Oh yeah, beautiful atomizer. Oh man. Spicy. Oh my man. Oh man. This is good. This is really good. You definitely get that sweetness in it, like cinnamon. Um it's supposed to have plum in it. You definitely get some plum. The sweetness, you definitely can get that. This smells really good. It's elegant. It's not overpowering. telling you guys this probably cost me i think forty dollars on free risk buy you gotta get your nose on this one. Oh man man let me go on to the notes i don't even know what the notes are in this fragrance i'll be right back the notes i'm 
back got the notes for this fragrance okay the notes in this fragrance are grapefruit plum orchid heliotrope vanilla amber oud benzoin tonka bean and lavender I spent a little time with this fragrance, you know, about a half an hour or so right now. So, um, you know, this fragrance, I, it projects for about a foot away right now. You know, that's pretty good with it. I still get whiffs of it all the time. You know, this fragrance is more, it's spicy. When it starts to dry down, is you get like vanilla, you get the vanilla. You know, you do get that plum in this fragrance. This fragrance, also is smoky like it's a light smokiness to this fragrance sweetness like a little leathery you know and that can be from the labdanum you know because that's what labdanum gives off in the fragrance and yes it has like a sweetness that sweetness that spiciness you know what i'm saying that spiciness is not coming from cinnamon I believe that's from the labdanum in this fragrance that's making it like kind of smoky spicy it's not too overpowering like i said before i believe with this fragrance or first impression i personally wouldn't do the way it's projecting off one spray that i smell like right now as i'm moving my hand around I would say no more than two sprays of this. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to be indoors, because it might not seem like this fragrance is like projects very well, but I'm telling you, I'm getting it right now. I'm smelling it. So um, I would say take it easy with this one. It definitely smells great, high quality. I feel like this fragrance right here will last on skin at least eight hours eight hours you know what i'm saying that's what i'm getting you know what i mean i believe that this will last eight hours last eight hours on your skin also this fragrance it smells like you can wear this from a mature 25 and up you know what i'm saying you know on your grown man just chill you know what i mean you know what i mean you're not overdoing anything like if you this is not a fragrance you wear if you over hype but this is a relaxed smooth chill laid back elegant fragrance you know what I'm saying? So, you know, if that's you, I believe you will enjoy this fragrance. This fragrance, you know, I can see you wearing this. This is just like a dress nice fragrance. You know what I'm saying? You don't, I feel like you don't have to dress it up. You can, you can dress this one up. You can dress it down. You know what I'm saying? But when you dress it down, just look nice. Look, look together. This, that's what I feel about this fragrance. I, I feel like this is just a together fragrance. Like, you know, wow, he looks really nice and he smell good. That's what I get from this fragrance. Um, from one to 10 with this fragrance, let's do it one more time, one more time. Man, that joint just, it's just a beautiful opening. A beautiful opening, the sweetness of it, that plum. And then that dry down with that vanilla, that smokiness, that that little light spiciness. It has like kind of a caramel, light caramel vanilla smell to it. You know what I'm saying? It's just a beautiful fragrance. So from one to 10 with this fragrance, I would give this fragrance a nine or first impressions. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely a good one, especially because of the quality great bottle you know what i'm saying it doesn't give off any alcohol or anything like that so i feel that this is one that you just have to get you know just you gotta go for it you know if you don't like the fragrance give it away you know what i'm saying give it to somebody for christmas or their birthday trust me someone will enjoy this fragrance if you don't you know what i'm saying so get your hands on this one eternal oud by latafa do me a favor, let me know if you had this fragrance or not, and if you like this fragrance, all right? Okay, listen, man, it's your boy, man. I wanna appreciate y'all. I got over 500 subscribers. You know, your boy is on the way to a thousand. So like, share, comment, help your boy out. So listen, man, I suggest these fragrances to you. I suggest these fragrances for someone special on their birthday. Get them for someone for the holidays. 
Get it for Valentine's Day. Get it for Easter. Hell, get it just cause. Cause y'all gonna smell good for each other. Look, that's my time. I'm your guy, Big Tools from Bond Fragrances, and I'm out. Boom. <laughs>